the scene. Today, members of the action group Fort Polk Progress met with Louisiana lawmakers in Washington. The group has been rallying support to save military jobs after the Army reported it was considering a troop reduction of up to 5,300 personnel. Democratic U.S. Senator Mary Landry says Fort Polk is vital to central Louisiana. And Fort Polk Progress President Reese says the senator has been instrumental in the successful efforts to expand and strengthen Fort Polk. And this military impact in our state is tremendous, particularly for central Louisiana, because it's less populated. They're not as large as cities as you would find in New Orleans or Baton Rouge or, let's say, Shreveport. Had she not been keenly focused on Fort Polk, making sure that it was resourced properly all these years, we wouldn't have had the one billion plus dollars of investment that have happened on base since 2005. Landers on the Senate Committee on Appropriations considered to be the most powerful panel on Capitol Hill.